Hello everybody, I'm Jeff Phillips and welcome to this week's webisode. Every week I bring in a new business to help share tips and advice within their industry. And today I have Bill Lindemuth. Bill, welcome to the show. Welcome, I'm glad to be here, Jeff, thank you. Yeah, sure. Why don't you explain to everyone a little bit about yourself and what you do? Okay. My daughter and I started Higher Rock Education about two years ago. And our focus is on educating young people on economic theory and also integrating Christian thought into that process. And we do it with an online course or online lessons. Okay, so that's a, a different business to get into. What uh, prompted you to, to, to get into that business? Oh, Jeff, I've had a passion for economics education for about 30 years, really, in that, um, you know, I, I've just seen with young people, they, we all vote our pocketbooks, and so many people are ignorant about how our economy works. So I want to educate our young people as best we can in terms of, of how does it work. Okay. Well, can you explain a little bit how you integrate the Christian teachings with economics? Oh, sure. I, to me, they're one and the same. They, they really are. God, okay, tells us that we are required, or it's our responsibility to use our resources in an efficient manner. Okay, he, he gives them to us for our use. We shouldn't abuse them, okay? Economics is the study of the use of scarce resources. How do we make decisions in terms of its use? So to me, they're one and the same. Okay, well, why don't you give us a quick little economic lesson? Can you explain to myself and, and to the viewers, you know, why, why do gas prices go up and down like a yo-yo? Oh man, there's so many things that enter into the gas prices. I mean, on a supply side, you have all of the issues concerning political disruptions, okay? Um, you have all sorts of issues concerning even weather, okay, in certain areas. Um, on the demand side, you have things like, okay, if, on, over the holidays, the price might go up a little bit because there's a greater demand for um, gasoline over that time frame. So it's, it's a whole bunch of issues. Then you also have taxes, okay, where the government might impose taxes on, on a gallon of gasoline. So there are all sorts of variables that go into the pricing of, of it, but it all boils down to really supply and demand. Okay, well, good information, and thank you for those that, 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 that advice and some of those tips. And if any of you out there are interested in finding out more about a higher rock education and even uh, seeing some lessons, please visit the website at the end of this video. And if you would like to continue this conversation online, please fill in the box below this video. So that's all we have for this week. Until next time, take care and bye-bye.